Hi, welcome to the video blog Pencil and Spoon. Um, we're going to do a couple of English beers, a couple of beers from Fuller's today. Um, just open them up, give them, a, give them a taste. Okay, so first of all here we've got the ESB, which is 5.9% kind of a, well, extra special bitter. Let's get it poured out. I read earlier this one's um, it's a dry hops, this, which was... I didn't know before, I read that earlier, I was quite surprised. Um, and then here we're going to open up the Golden Pride. Now, I'm at my girlfriend's house today, just driven over it, got here to record this and realised that I'd actually forgotten the beers. So, I've just driven back again and picked them up. Idiot. Okay, now this is the uh, this is Golden Pride, this is 8.5%. It's kind of a um, barley wine kind of style, strong ale. Now I've got the ESB, it's a nice um, kind of russet, um, amber, brown colour, big nose of fruit, oh, lots of apples and pears, very fresh smelling. So the thing about the, the Fuller's beers, I think they've got this uh, a wonderful bready, bready flavour to them, which I think is great. Mm. And the bready flavour definitely comes through, it's quite boozy, 5.9%, that's fairly strong. But it's also fairly sweet. There's candy sugar in there. Um, there's a decent hot presence. Um, certainly not too overpowering though. Mm. But yeah, definitely kind of this clinging bitterness, which is which which finishes it off very nicely. And then we've got the uh, the golden pride here. Slightly less fierce, slightly less bubble, slightly redder, a bit more bronze. Mm, not not quite such a big aroma, surprisingly, but it's, it's a lot sweeter, a lot more condensed um, fruit sweetness. Maybe things like um, strawberries and honey. Mm, mm. It's lovely, it's so rich and big and strong. and um, There's loads of toffee malt in there, um, loads, of, loads of things like that. It's also kind of got this spiciness at the end to, to finish it. It's wonderfully, for 8.5%, it's very, very drinkable, it's very good. Mm. Now, there is a reason that we have both of these two here, and that is because we've got this book, which is Garrett Oliver's The Brewmaster's Table. Uh, Discovering the pleasures of real beer with real food. Now this, is, this has got to be my favourite beer book at the moment, I absolutely love this book. It's really kind of got me more and more into the food and beer side of it. I really, really should get this book if you're interested in beer in any way. But there's one thing in particular which I like, which if you've got it and you've read it, and you've turned to page 135, um, let's read. When I was living in London, my friend John and I were devotees of a blend we called the Peacemaker. One day I asked a barman to fill half my pint with Fuller's sturdy ESB bitter and then top it up with a small bottle of Fuller's very strong Golden Pride barley wine. So. Here we are, we're going to have a bit of a mix. Now I always thought that I wouldn't be into this whole beer mixing thing. I thought beers are made um, as kind of complete products, almost like a book is made as a book and you wouldn't find two books and splice them together and create a whole new story. This is kind of not how they work, but recently I've done a few little mixes. Um, I've done a, a Thornbridge Jaipur with uh, St Petersburg, their um, Imperial Stout. It was kind of a really interesting mix of the the really strong stout and the roasted grain with the massive hops. Kind of really interesting. Um, and I'm, I'm kind of fascinated by it a little bit more now, so let's try it out. We're going to do a, roughly a 50 50 mix. Let's leave a little bit in there. Now, the colour, I mean, the colour's not going to tra change much anyway, it's still got that, that hue of, um, kind of the orangey amber bronze. Mmm. Oh, that's lovely. Lovely aroma, lovely sweetness, lots of uh, bread in there, but also the caramel. Mmm. Wow. That's really good. Um, you get... The strength comes through from this, but you also get a really nice smooth base from the ESB. Um, there's plenty of sweetness in there. There's, this has got a lot of extra sweetness than the ESB. Um, but then you get the hops to finish it all off. And it becomes this kind of really great, really great little mix. Hmm. Yeah. 
That kicks ass, I like that, I like that a lot. Very nice. Okay, so there we go, that's it, it's just a little quick one just to mix them all up. Um, I've got a bag full of cheese, so I'm going to have cheese for dinner and enjoy the rest of these beers. So yeah, this one, cheers to uh, Garrett Oliver, the peacemaker. <laughs>